In this video, I'm going to be doing indefinite integration. And I will be finding the antiderivative of the following functions. Now, what do I mean by the antiderivative? For example, if I wanted to find the antiderivative of 3x to the first, I'm asking myself the question, what is 3x to the first a derivative of, and how do I find it? The first step is for me to bring the 3 out. Then, I multiply the 3 by the antiderivative of x to the first power. So it's going to be 3 times x. Then you add 1 to the first power. Then you divide by 1 plus 1. That will give you 3x squared over 2 plus c, the constant of integration. Now, I'm going to go back and prove that 3x to the first power is a derivative of 3x squared over 2 plus c. The derivative of 3x squared over 2 plus c equals 3x squared, then you subtract 1 from the 2, over 2, then you multiply by 2, then you take the derivative of a constant, which is 0. And that will give you, and the 2's cancel, that's 0. That will leave you with 3 times x to the first power. And that's what we started off with. Okay, now, I'm asking myself, what is 2x squared a derivative of? Now, I bring the 2 out. Then I multiply the 2 by the antiderivative of x squared. x squared, then you add 1 to the 2, and divide it by, and divide it by 2 plus 1. That gives you 2 times x cubed over 3 plus c, the constant of integration. Now I'm going to go back and I'm going to prove that 2x squared 
is the derivative of 2x cubed over 3. The derivative of 2x cubed over 3 plus c equals Two times x cubed, then you subtract one from the three, divide by three, and then you multiply by three, and the derivative of a constant is zero. And you are left with, and threes cancel. And now you have 2 times x squared, which is that. Non problem number three. I'm asking myself the same question. What is 5x cubed a derivative of? I bring the 5 out. Then I multiply the 5 by the antiderivative of x cubed. You got x cubed. Then you add 1 to the 3. Then you divide the whole thing by 3 plus 1. That equals 5x to the 4th over 4 plus c. Now I'm going to go back and prove that 5x cubed is the derivative of 5x to the 4th over 4 plus c. The derivative of 5x to the 4th divided by 4 plus c, the constant of integration, equals, you've got 5, x to the 4th, subtract 1 from the 4, divided by 4, then you multiply by 4, plus the derivative of a constant, constant c, zero. So the answer will be five, okay, the fourth cancel, x cubed, because you subtract one from the four. And this brings me to the end of the video. Like, share, and subscribe. Like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for your attention.